Batista? What the hell were you doing in JBL's limo just now? What? Me? I could ask you the same question. What are you doing here at a SmackDown pay-per-view? Austin sent me here to look for suspicious behavior. And you getting out of the WWE Champion's limo seems pretty suspicious to me. Look, you've got it all wrong. I'm trying to get to the bottom of the situation just like you. I came here to confront JBL about his plan to handicap Raw. He told me since Stone Cold's the new general manager, he's given up on it. Let me get this straight. You say you weren't just conspiring with JBL in the comfort of his limousine. Instead, you were confronting JBL about his takeover? But now JBL says that he's just gonna give up anyway? And I suppose you'll say you believed him. No, as a matter of fact, I didn't believe him and I challenged him to a match. I was gonna destroy him tonight and put an end to his plans myself. If you went in on that, we'll make it a tag team match. But if you're calling me a liar, then you and I can settle this right here, right now. I think good old JR might have called that match a damn slobber knocker. Hell, I can't wait to see you two mix it up at WrestleMania for the World Heavyweight title. Yeah, WrestleMania. Look, Steve, about the title match. I was hoping we could sort of postpone that for a bit. Just you know until we figure out who's working for JBL around here. You gotta be kidding me. Postpone the main event of WrestleMania? The granddaddy of them all? What kind of champion are you, Batista? I'll tell you no! what. No! It's that damn JBL! He just took out Austin with the WWE title! Oh my gosh! The Sheriff and the Deputy are down! That damn Batista! He was a traitor after all! Orton and Benoit were right! I knew it! I've got a message for all the Raw superstars in the locker room and for the millions watching at home tonight. You are looking at the new gold standard of sports entertainment. Together, the WWE and World Heavyweight Champions will form the most dominant alliance in the history of this business. And before long, Raw will be just an unpleasant memory. Oh my God, Triple H just ambushed Booker T in the parking lot. Looks like he hit him with a pipe. No, not the pedigree, on the concrete floor! Triple H is trying to take out the competition before Survivor Series. We gotta get some guys down here. Whoa, Booker just got carjacked. How the hell did Triple H get into SmackDown's designated parking lot? Raw wasn't supposed to have access to it. What's going on? Batista, what the hell are you doing? You just let a Raw superstar into a SmackDown part of the arena. Hey, chill out. We're just catching up. No big deal. No big deal? After what happened to Booker last week? You think this is no big deal? I've got a submission match against Flair tonight. Hey, believe me, when it comes time to face him in the ring, I'll do what needs to be done. But until then, he's the guy who taught me everything I know, and I'm not gonna avoid him just because Teddy Long tells me to. You've got a lot of history with Triple H, too. I don't suppose you let him over here last week. I don't think I like where this is going. How about you just go and get ready for your match and stay the hell out of my business? Understand? I don't know about that, Cole. I mean, I want to trust Batista, but... But face it, Taz. SmackDown can't afford to blindly trust anyone. Not when there's a traitor in the ranks. Player, it's theater alone. Listen. Booker just called me and says he thinks Batista is our traitor. Now, I'm inclined to agree that it looks bad, 
But I want us to be unanimous on this before we do anything. I need you to think about it and let me know your decision. Holla. Booker threw Batista out of the ring like he was taking out the trash. Think about it, sweetheart. He kind of was. What the hell? What's Booker doing? Come on, what's going on now? Booker's working with Team Raw. Booker T was the traitor all along, and Flair set up Batista to make him look guilty. Oh my God, what an impact. Oh man, this is bad news. Bad news for SmackDown. SmackDown just got played big time. Someone's gotta come out here and stop this. Whoa. out of him. This is tough to watch. Oh my God! I think this guy is the masked man, and I'm gonna call him out. For weeks now, someone has been trying to get under my skin like a rash. First with code, then with sneak attacks. Kennedy, I found the masked man's mask in your bag. You cost me the WWE Championship. And somehow you got your own little title shot tonight. If you think I'm gonna sit down for that, you better get that swelled head of yours checked. Get out here! Uh-oh, here he comes. But he's supposed to have a championship match tonight, JR. Somebody get in there and stop these two. Jericho, I'll whip you in front of everybody right now. It's The Undertaker. He's back. Could this be what I think it is? We're going to see these two go at it at WrestleMania? Oh, I'm getting goosebumps, Cole. This is a dream match of epic proportions. Oh, well, here we go. These two do not like each other. Yeah, somebody should separate these two. Attacking Taker was a bad idea. Oh, well, you're right about that. And I think he's going to pay for it. I'm not here to fight you, Sean. I'm here to call off the bounty. To put things back the way they should be. 
All you need to do is agree to fight me at WrestleMania in a retirement match. Sure, take your time, Sean. Think it over. What the hell is Punk thinking? He's turned on his floor. Sean, I know I said I was gonna watch your back tonight, and I decided to come out here and help. To help you retire. JBL offered me the quarter million dollar bounty. And besides, with you gone, I move one step higher in the technology. I was surprised when I heard that the number one contender decided to stay on SmackDown and challenged John Cena for the WWE title at WrestleMania. Now, some might say that jumping to Raw would be an easier path. But he's staying here. I don't have to like him, but I've got to respect that. You feel me? But let's not get sentimental. We're four days away from the granddaddy of them all, WrestleMania. I've given WWE champion John Cena the night off so he can get ready for his title offense. But his challenger ain't going to be so lucky, you dig? Tonight, he's going to compete in not one, not two, but three matches. A submission match against Kurt Angle, a first blood match against JBL, and finally, a ladder match against Eddie Guerrero. Mm -hmm.